going back to 1992 when I lost my sister Charlotte, uh, lived, lived about 300 feet northeast of us across the wash here, the rodeo wash. Um, we, ha we had heard about it, you know, and uh, we're busy raising the family and working. And, um, uh, you know, so uh, we weren't too concerned about it until later, a few years later, you know, after losing my sister then, uh, getting aware, you know, that we're losing more people in the neighborhood from different cancers, including lupus. And uh, so when I lost my sister Charlotte, it was, uh, it, was, it was pretty hard for me. Then I got more involved then, uh, and I, then I went and got involved at uh, the Pueblo Neighborhood Center, that I'm one of the original members uh, to, to build the Pueblo Neighborhood Center back in the 70s. We had our meetings, uh, the operations committee, um, uh, Abe, uh, uh, Abe Campillo, and, and uh, there were more ladies in that committee than men, and we had our meetings, like many other meetings for other community uh, events in, uh, at, here at C. Rosa Elementary uh, Cafeteria and, uh, and uh, Library. So that goes back in the, to way back in the 70s. So then I went to, to uh, the Pueblo Neighborhood Center to get uh, more information from the previous members that have been involved in concern, concerned directly with the TCE problem.